Hi guys, today we're doing my May favorites. It's been like four eves since I have done a May favorite. I mean, not a May favorite, a monthly favorite since February. That's been forever. But I really want to get back into doing them because I've been like discovered some Amaze Ball products. So, that was my dog. Just like, I'm like, I gotta share them with y'all because you need to chat them out. So, we gonna go ahead and get started. Okay, starting off with foundation, my all-time favorite foundation, like, you need this foundation, has been the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation. This one's in 210. It's, like, the perfect match for me once it's on my skin. And I'm obsessed-so with it. It's a very, very, um, woohoo! Some of it fell out, okay? You know, I'll scoop this up. So, it has a very, um, so I gotta cover that. Um, it has, like... And it blends just like, like a dream, like, you don't even know, like, it like covers and then, but it still looks like you're not wearing foundation, so I love this oh so much. And I am just totes obsessed with it. This is my, my all-time favorite drugstore foundation. And my favorite thing to apply this with has been the Soho London beauty sponge it's kind of like a dupe for a beauty blender it's just got like the two ends on both sides but um i didn't clean it but i love it oh so much and you need this victoria gave this to me and i want to thank her oh so much this is the bomb diggity okay so my all-time favorite powder brush for this month well actually it's kabuki has been from Bare Minerals. Victoria gave this to me again. Like, I don't tell her to give this to me, okay? Let's get that cleared. But anyways, um, I love it. It's just like, um, it's not super soft, which I kind of like. And it's very, um, dense and but fluffy kind of at the same time. And it's great. It covers a lot and I'm obsessed oh so. Woohoo. Blinding heaven's light. But I love it. And it's from Bare Central or Bare Minerals, whatever you want to call the brand. I call it Bare Minerals. Mascara smeared. Okay. But, okay, my yeah. two favorite blushes for this month has first been one from L'Oreal. It's the L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Blush. This one's in Baby Blossom. Oh my gosh, okay. So, like, I am, like, down to the edge. Um, Victoria 2016 gave it to me. And so she had already used some of it, but oh my gosh, such a perfect color. Do you see that? Do you see that? Like you can still get it, and it's like a perfect look. And my all-time favorite blush to br blush brush to apply it with has been the Bare Essentials Flawless Face Brush. This is the full size, and I just like apply that to my cheeks. Ah. <clears throat> Yeah, it's just been really, really great, um, and it helps blend it just really, really well. And I also like to, sorry, to use this to blend with my bronzer so it looks more natural. Yeah. Um, so my all-time favorite um, contouring brush has been this one from Elf. It's from their Gem Collection. Technically, this is a um, blush, angled blush brush, but I personally like it more for contour because it draws like that great line. And it just looks really great. Um, I love it so much. Um, I think this was like five dollars, so it's not that expensive. But the only reason it was five dollars and it's from Elf is because it was part of the gym collection. Okay, my all-time favorite highlighter is technically a blush. Everything keeps falling because I got a new filming spot because we're moving, so we have to like move everything. So like by choose Monday and Tuesday, like. My room will be completely empty, and it'll be a sad day. I'm moving to Italy, y'all. Oh my gosh, I am so sad. I'm not looking forward to it at all. I mean, I'm not saying, like, I'm ungrateful to go to Italy. It's just, like, I don't want to leave all my friends. Like, I found a great horse barn. I mean, I have you guys here. I mean, I'll still have you guys when I move to Italy, but still. I have great friends. I have a great horse barn. I, I like... Two horses that I absolutely love, and I'm just gonna be so sad to leave it. But yeah, um, uh, I'll probably not vlog, but I'll post a but buttload of pictures to Instagram. My Instagram is horsey underscore girl one two five. 
Okay. Follow me. Check me out. Any hoozies. My favorite highlighter has been the Dream Bouncy Blush and Candy Coral. Okay. I have a feeling this actually is in Rose Petal because, like, I saw the other Candy Coral one. It looks way darker than this because, like, it was in the Candy Coral section and the, like, the back was torn off. Woohoo! And this is, like, the last one there, so I bought it. Well, yeah. But I think this is probably Rose Petal. Does that look like rose petal? I think it is. But it, these bouncy blushes are cream based. It's just got like all this shimmer, so I'm like. Boom. I just like it for highlighting, and it's like $6. So I don't like the fact that it's $6. Well, I got this at the dollar store, so, but it originally it's like 8 and I don't like the fact that it's $8. Okay, so my all time favorite eyeshadow palette for this month, it's a really big palette has been from Elf. It's the 144 Ultimate Eyeshadow Palette. Uh, okay. Okay, y'all. Look how amazing this palette is. I can't, like... I've been really using this color as, like, my base. And then I've been taking... Which color was it? This color. And this color, like, mix them together and put that in my crease. I think it looks... Perf. And then this color in my brows, but I got a eyebrow cake powder, but I didn't get that till June, and it's June right now. So that won't be in my mom. Eh, never mind. I don't want to give anything away. But yeah, um, I've been loving those colors, and I've been loving like the brides for a pop of color. So I highly recommend that palette to you. Let's put that right up there. And then my all-time favorite mascara for this month has been the CoverGirl Clump Crusher. And Victoria gave this to me again. Um, oh my gosh, okay. It gives amazing volume and it does not clump. And if it does clump, it has these um, fine tooth bristles that like comb it out. If it does. And this is just all around a great mascara. So I do highly recommend it. And it's amazing and you need that mascara if you can only buy one mascara and get this mascara that would be my only really, um my all-time favorite lip like moisturizer has been the nivea lip butter i have like eaten through this it's the raspberry rose kiss <clears throat> i've hit pan y'all look at that i've hit pan It's the Nivea Lip Butter and, Butter and Raspberry Rose Kiss. Um, I got this for $2. It's originally 4 but my mom had a $2 off coupon. But the only thing I don't like about this particular one, see how it's kind of pinky? If you put a lot, it'll like show up like white on your lips. But yeah, I usually put something over it, so it's not that big of a deal. Okay, I, do, okay, I do not have a favorite lip color for this month. But, okay, camera sliding again. I'm sorry. This, like, it's slick right here. But, yeah, um, I'm going to move on to my favorite nail color. Okay, the first one that I'm obsessed with is by Zoya. I got this from an Ipsy Glam Bag. This one's in Jacqueline. Jack Wait, is that upside down to you? Yeah. It's just a really pretty nude color, and I have it on my nails right now. And that's like one coat, y'all. This is like insanely pigmented right here. It looks sheer and, and okay. Awful, awful lighting. I'm gonna turn that off really quick. It looks sheer in the bottle, but it's actually not, and I love it. Wait, do you like that better? No, that's still blinding heavy light. Okay, sorry. And I just love it, and I don't know how much this was because I got an Ipsy Glam bag. But I'm guessing it was like $8. Um, the next is by Essie. The rest of these are from Essie, by the way. And it's this beautiful metallic sea blue color. Or just... This one's in Aruba Blue, and I am obsessed with this color. I'm not going to open it because my hands are slight because of lotion. And I just love it, and it's metallic. You need this nail polish. Next is also from... Well, duh, the rest of these are from Essie. But this one's in Mint Candy Apple. Oh my gosh, it makes me hungry. Okay. Camera sliding. I hate this camera right now. But it's this mint color and it's on my nails, obviously. It's like greenish blue and gorge. 
Next is the nail polish. It's from Essie, and it's in Penny Talk. It's a beautiful metallic gold color. Oh, my gosh. And I love these. Ah! Oh, so much. These are my four must-haves for this month. Okay, y'all, that's my entire monthly favorites. I hope y'all enjoy. Bye!